guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to bringing two episodes one to three of the special premiere of Bun Diddy, It's My Girl. So, okay, of course, as you know me, number one, um, with my videos, of course, I can't record an hour long. So we're going to do it in two parts, but you're still going to get the whole all three episodes so in one half it'll be episode one and two together because when i downloaded this file i thought that it was three separate episodes all together so that i could have three separate videos all in one but no they decided to put all three in like a big cinematic movie which i'm not mad at so you'll get episode one and two together and then three by itself but it'll still all be in one video so with these girls i the only thing i i know a couple of things about these girls i just know two girls who um their voice actresses have been in some other things that i have seen i just can't really remember them right now um one of them is i think it's the drummer and of course it's the main singer um two of course and it's not really obvious we all kind of knew this was going to happen these girls are now officially confirmed to be in the game, but at a later date. I'm not really surprised, but at the same time I am, I did get a chance, I think a while back ago, um, before this was announced, um, I got to listen to their music and I really like their songs. And so, um, as someone who is a Rosalia stan, uh, I feel like I just kind of got another group because I, I do like... If you know me, Rosalia is, is my group, number one. But I also do like Razor Stillin songs and stuff. Um, of course, even though, like I said, Rosalia is my top. Lisa is my best girl. I do have best girls from all the other units and such. Um, Razor Stillin, I feel like I mix sometimes, but I feel like it's more um, lock, of course. Um, and then looking at more funny cut, it is Toko, aka Marine from Dress Up Darling. And then from this, I really don't know yet. I do think they all look interesting. Um, I'm really excited to get to know these girls a lot more. It's going to probably give me feels towards the guy version. Um, so I cannot pronounce their name. Avi, Avigunas, I think that was how, what it said, um, for the series and how I really did like that show as well. And how it was very underrated. But I feel like this is going to be just as good and such. And I'm really excited to see how this goes for these group of girls. The things that they're going to go through. I do love the fact that this is kind of taking place almost like mm, maybe after graduation for our initial girls. Because, of course, majority of them have graduated. They're now on to college for some of them. And some of them are still at their residential schools getting into their senior year. So, really, it's just, like, who knows? So, slowly but surely, like, I'm kind of hoping that all my other girls from original Vendity end up making appearances in this. But if not, that is okay. But... Um, enjoy the video, and I will see you guys all next time. Bye! Okay, part one in three, two, one, go. Even. Mm. Oh, she's made up her mind.
Well, hold up, wait. Ooh, somebody stay in silent. Damn. I feel for him. And I feel like everybody's just going to disband at that moment. I love the pink and black suitcases. Oh, you're so pretty. Oh. Look at her trench coat. It's so cute. She looks so mature. It's so cute. Oh my god. I think you did well. Hmm? Hmm? I'm gonna laugh if it's Akko. Hmm? No? So would she be a first year? See, no. Let me ask that. Are all these girls first year? Because I haven't looked about the year they are. Oh, she's so precious. No. Wait, hold on. Are you going to eat lunch by yourself? Hello, the one who was in front of you. The Mori. Somebody. True. Yeah, but she's cute. She's so adorable. Oh my god.
Mm-hmm. What the heck is Tonani doing in the background? Yep. <laughs> I will do this so cute. My room's beautiful. Oops, sorry. I know that's right. Well, hopefully we get more context on that. Oh. <laughs> Or you could just make a saying yourself looking for members. I mean, you have one. Tomati. Woody. Mm -mm. No, she just rather be on her own. At least she was kind of polite in a bitchy way. Smorty.
Oh, that's sweet. Oh, there you are. Oh, that's <laughs> she gonna make me cry. Oh my god, she's too adorable. Aww. Yeah. But you like them, don't you? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just one. But it's- oh! Money, no! Look at this, the other- ah! <laughs> That's what I want. It, it doesn't even- they don't even have to be voiced. You can just show me that. I'm like, oh! Did you write it? And why? No pressure. Do you think that, you know, if you join another band, they'll all leave you? Come on, Muddy! <laughs> So this would be the first, well, because typically when looking at the other bands, they're, they're all either from the same school or separate. This is the first band where they're using all three schools. Honestly, that's good. I mean, I get it, but... Oh. 
But sometimes you can't go back to the way they were. Oh. She's, she's so sweet. I, I love the fact that she wants to bring everybody back together and ish. But I think in her heart, she just knows it's not going to work out. That's different. <laughs> Poor baby. Thank you. <laughs> you sure? Oh, baby, you just gotta try. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's because she wrote it. Mm -hmm. And it. Muddy, no, don't see that. <laughs> oh Oh wait Uh. Money. Mm. Woo! This girl is hot, 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 hot. Hang angry fire, baby. No. Yeah, please, like, uh, we know that, like, yes, y'all banned, disbanded, but this is her second chance. This is all of your second chance. Okay. Mori, she's adorable. Oh, my God. Seriously. Oh, she might be best girl. I and I don't want to say that just yet, but, like, she's so flipping cute. Like, oh, my God.
damn like oh like she warms my heart i mean now seeing initially the three of them plus i think it's the brown haired girl and i think the one who's doing ballet i think she's the other one who's supposed to be left it makes me want to go well we're, we're gonna see something else after this because when we go into episode two and i think they're gonna show the opening um they're all cool now the one who was playing piano I do like her. I just don't like the fact where she's like, I don't want to be in a group anymore. And I get it. I completely understand it. If you feel those feelings, then yes, go ahead and voice those feelings. And then if you say, hey, I want to disband from this group. I want to move on from my life. Like, it's just not as fun. But um, the girl who was doing ballet, when she said, like, I haven't had fun since the beginning of this, like, that really hurt like damn like no matter what y'all were doing together and every performance you were doing you felt nothing and you had um the the brown haired girl who kind of reminds me of lisa in a little bit um who really truly wanted to keep this group together and to bring everybody back but sometimes as i said it may not work out like that also kasumi and rosalia baby All right, let's see what happens now. And of course, these two about to have an even bigger argument. Yes. You got to give her more context. You can't just leave like that. Yeah, the silver hair girl on the far right is the only one we're looking for. so pretty <laughs> so then i wonder the girl the last chick with the um two different eye colors where the heck is she coming from? And where, what school is she going to go to? Yeah, how are you going to talk to Moody? 
Well, I am. No. Oh my god. <laughs> I'll still take one. Um, she was in front of it yesterday, but... <laughs> Oak rock band, okay. Is she ready? Mm hmm. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They were in a group together as well. <laughs> Complicated. Mm hmm If we, if I don't see Mimi mean, and Tay and Alisa, I'm be so pissed. Oh, that's her! I love the fact that she has unique eyes out of, like, everyone because it's pretty. <laughs> Give me a go, here she goes! Mm-hmm.
same. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Yeah. Ah, baby just go at her own speed. Hey, she doing that. She is eating it up. Like, oh my God. She goes. I love how she quickly, her demeanor and her attitude and stuff change with the conversation. Like, oh, See, I felt like, as her saying the support thing, like, she's going to be the one who's probably going to take the longest to officially be a part of the group. Because, of course, even in that moment, she's analyzing and questioning everything. Yeah, I feel like we we need to get the context on this. That's the thing of still not only the other reasons of them breaking up, like their beginning, their middle, we know their end, we need to see everything else and such. And so how 
the rest of them are going to be. Where she she desperately wants everything to go back to normal. But as I said, some things just won't work out that way. Oh. <laughs> Uh, uh, wait, wait, maybe like I'm gonna walk right past her. Nope. Are we gonna see Sayo in the background? That's <laughs> Sayo. Hey, I'm Sayo and Sayo. Hell, are we gonna see Tomoe too? You're making things even more complicated. Just once again, go up to her and just say, drop it. I don't want to be in a group anymore. Maybe she should also go to the rich girl, girl school. I mean, because she has that attitude as, but she she's sweet. I like her. In her own way, she's sweet. Oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> it's okay y'all will be the best of friends by the end of this series okay so you need a keyboardist you need a drummer and you need a singer mm-hmm Oh, come on, be nice.
I'm getting hella font on Maiden Vibes with this. I'm not mad at that. Oh. Did you talk to her? Really beautiful voice. Okay. All right. I, I love the fact that we're getting more context on it. And I love how Anon wants to know the truth and such. But I feel like it, it's going to take Mori, in my opinion, a little time. I don't. I think maybe by episode three we might have our three, and then Taki might join. Maybe by the end of episode three, or probably by episode four. I can see this group being together at least by maybe episode six. At the latest, I'm not 100 percent sure about that. But I mean, I, I get it now. Soyo. Let me talk. We gotta talk about her because she's kind of now in the running of best girl. I feel like now all five of them are kind of in the running. Um, she, I, I love her demeanor and how the way she does her things and stuff and how she talks and especially when she wants to convey a certain thing, especially when she was talking about Moni with Anon, Ion. She was just like, okay, so you know her. Like, you're talking about this one. And, oh, hey, we used to be in a band together. This is her singing. Yada, yada, yada. Da, 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 da. Um, but at the same time, she's hiding the facade of still she would be a support member. But at the same time, it's like she knows she still wants to get these girls back together. Because it's like her quote, unquote, family. If she doesn't have them, she has nothing. And to see these girls instantly go from their middle school era ending this group and then going into high school and they're not able to move on as a group together is sad. You really genuinely feel bad for these girls as this former five going on to their separate places. Now, I understand the girl with the pigtails um, and the long, I want to say light-ish blue hair. I get it. Um... She was done. She didn't want to continue on. But there's still a lot of unanswered questions with the baggage of it on why she didn't want to do it. Now, with the ballet girl, like I said, she gave her answer because she she felt like she wasn't having fun since the beginning of it. Now, maybe it could have also been to the fact is with Mori, her voice and, you know, her... um. 
not only per per I can't speak performance, but trying to you know reach out to the audience and to get that emotion and stuff didn't convey as much. And so I think possibly the girl who gave her the bottle of water, aka the one who left, must have also felt like that too. And so she's like, you know what? I don't want to be a part of a group that I made that isn't on the same level as me. So it's like, screw it, I'm leaving. And you guys can do whatever the heck you want to. So the other ones really had no choice but to say, okay, we're kind of really on hiatus. There is nothing else that we can do right now. So with Anon coming in, with Ion coming in, it is a new thing because she is the newest girl. She's coming in and trying to figure out everything. But at the same time, she secretly wants to be in a band too. And so I think going into episode three and we're learning more about this, I think officially, yes, Mori will officially be a part of the group and maybe Taki as well. If not, I can say about five, six, whatever. But who really knows? But go ahead and pause the video and I will see you in one second for the final episode of this special three part. <laughs> okay, episode three or final part in three, two, one, go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, baby. You are human, sweetie. You just unique. She wasn't trying to do that. No. <laughs> she was trying to get the flower. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Don't read that. No. <laughs> Home, rich girl, da. Songwise, it's beautiful. Very beautiful. Me talking. Do the baby. <laughs> thank you so thank you. Oh my god.
I know, it's so beautiful. I mean, I get that. Uh oh. oh wait! Sucky. I think this is the only group that when we're looking at my glow in a nutshell they're the only group that does not one well, no 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 do does morphonica have a no i think morphonica does have pianist because of course the their special thing is the violin um but yeah no one has a keyboard <laughs> in this group well in the my girl group but in this one yes they did Be rude. And you should convey your voice from your heart. Mm hmm Look at I You know what I do want to know? Um since I haven't really heard much, you know, because ISAU fortunately had to leave and graduate from playing her. Have they found her replacement yet or no? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I mean, but they had to though already because, like, the game has how many songs of theirs?
beautiful. It's so beautiful that she cried. I love it. Oh, that was sweet. <laughs> Did she? <laughs> oh, you guys. You did good! <laughs> That's probably the only time, the one and only time when they all truly felt happy. Yep, muting is the new blocking. What's wrong? And this is, mm -hmm, and now we're going to see that. And that had to be a reason also why she quit officially. Right? And then she says what she's going to say.
But he lost everything. And then, of course, if no one else shows up, then what? what's the point of still being in a band, you know? Oh, no! Okay, so it had to be due to a comment. It, it's usually always like that. And I think for Saki, it really broke her and it broke her a lot. And it's just like, okay, in the end, I'm done. Now, if we could have seen what the comment was, then okay, then I could, you know, emphasize with her right now a little bit more. I do feel bad for her. I feel more bad for Taki, um, Soyo, and Mori because they all truly wanted this. The other two, Saki and, um, I'm guessing Misumi, well, um, they didn't really want it as much. And so with what Sophia is saying, like, I, at the truth, I really wasn't having fun since the beginning of this. It's really, truly sad. And my thing was, Saki was the one who fought this. And you want to back out. And it just, it really hurts. I do hope the song that they did perform together at their first live will eventually be used for my go and such. And to make it, and to elevate it. And make it even more beautiful. And I think truly this is, we're now seeing the journey of slowly but surely, surely Ion slowly coaxing both... <laughs> So, uh, Soyo, Taki, and Mori. It's just gonna take time. <laughs> but they are sweet together, truly. And, and it is sad that, you know, this group, this former group at the beginning of the series, that they broke up and we could have possibly seen more of them. Very much so. But at the same time, I think for the three of them who have moved on into my go, they're now getting the, the justice that they truly want and being with the new group. Yeah, it's a little hard because like when you're so used to one group and then officially, you know, you're disbanding because of something and then you're in a new thing with new girls and you don't know how everybody is going to go. Um, but when you're with two other girls that you know and two new girls that you don't know, you are gonna be like mm, I don't know but it is going to take some time for um Soyo Taki and Mori to warm up to Ion and the other girl whose name I really Rana I think that was her name um and such but I think you know when mm, this is now three so about maybe like two three weeks from now like I said by episode six or seven um hopefully they are together as a group. They are able to play their new song as a group together. Uh, or use this song that was portrayed in this episode. And once again, elevate it to even to make it even more beautifully. But I mean, for honestly, a first thought for these first few episodes, I really did enjoy this a lot. I think these girls really just have a lot to go through and it's just the same you know as with popping party all the way to freaking morphonica and these girls are going to get very popular very fast even though i think as of right now they are popular and such i do love the fact is even with this series we're getting all almost maybe everyone from the previous gen and stuff i really cannot wait to see more girls show up hopefully my best girl lisa comes in in the next couple of weeks and such um 
I, I still like secretly and this is like hopefully it happens I would still want to see this show do a collab with D4DJ because majority of those girls are in D4DJ so it would make the most sense to do it um but really it, it's just up to the higher ups and what they want to do because we're I think the last collab Bunzity did like we they're doing the Chainsaw Man collab which I, I love and I would love to get those cards I'm definitely going to save those save for those when I get to Ian because I don't think I have a lot of gems in my JP account um but I, I really, truly want to see more. And honestly, these girls are going to do beautifully. I, I definitely want to listen to more of their music now, even though I already had a couple of songs already on my phone. And I really enjoyed them. Like, it's just when you listen to any of the bands and stuff, you just feel so many different emotions. Like, any any Rosalia song, I can kind of now, like, I, I used to be like, well, no. Some of them I cried at. Now, really, I cry at any Rosalia song because they're just so freaking good and I love them so much. Popping Party will always make me happy. Same thing with, ha uh, I'm about to say happy around. Hello, happy world. Um, Afterglow gives me so much nostalgic, like, vibes and just wanting to go and watch a sunset so much because that is their thing. Um... Pasta Palettes, of course, Idols in a nutshell, and they're just bubblegum pop, but I love them. Morphonica is different, but not a bad different, a good different, but I still love their music just as much. Like, there's music, their music gives me feels of when I just want to relax and stuff, and I, and I really do love that. Raise the ceiling? Mm. It's just when I really want to rock out, like truly, truly, truly rock out. And I think with these girls, with my goal, it's probably going to be the same of how I feel with Rosalia, where I definitely um, have gotten a lot of emotions out in the song. Cried, sad, you know, happy, whatever and such. But you can really feel those emotions that um, what he's say you is definitely giving out and so I honestly cannot wait to see what the what's in store for the rest of these girls and what they're going to be doing while they're still doing this main job and whatever other animes they do after this show is currently over but other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episodes one two three of Bunzity. it's my go if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join master squad and of course i will see you guys all officially next time for probably because this is what i feel like this is going to do so we got to talk about this real quick before i go so since they put out the first three episodes I have a feeling that they're going to try to get this show out very quickly. Um, I don't think a lot of us were expecting the first three episodes to come out. Um, so I'm guessing probably what they're going to do because they, they kind of did this with season two and season three of Benzity. Um, and Benzity finished like I think five weeks in of whatever season was um, airing at the time. So I feel like when we get into the following week we're going to probably get either two episodes per week or the initial one, whatever. But it is it is what it is. Whatever they decide to do with it, I'll be okay with it. It's really interesting to do multiple episodes at once. The, it, it doesn't feel like the story goes by quicker. It's just, okay, it's good because I think they know their fan base and stuff and they really want to know a lot more information very very quickly in a really timely manner i get the reason of why they're doing it i kind of wish like a lot of other idol shows would do that kind of same thing but i get it because we are promoting this series a lot that they're like okay hey we gotta go we gotta get this out very quickly so it is what they want to do if they do it continuously I am fine with that if not if they want to do it by one episode each that is okay too but of course we'll either see if if it's just four or if it's four and five but until then I will see you guys all next time bye